How are you, man? Good, and yourself? Good. Uh, so, how, how's camp going so far, man? Camp, camp is going great. Everybody had the right attitude ahead of the day. And every day, everybody come out here with a lot of enthusiasm. And everybody working fast and hard. Can you, can you just talk about what pro, uh, approach you took going into spring and how you feel like uh, that maybe helped you? Okay, with the approach into spring, when I came in, I started off as myself. I put myself as being on the bottom because I'm considered a walk-on, so I said, so I gotta work hard and move fast with everything I do, so I gotta work hard and work harder than everyone else to get on top. And, and how do you feel like, the, what do you feel like of the impression you made and, and what it's done for you in terms of getting the coaches to believe in you and then get you some, you know, oh, I feel I feel like I um, made a big impression, but I just gotta keep getting better and better every day. It don't stop getting better and better. Where do you see you making an impact this year? Mostly impact, I think I'll make an impact on um, special teams. I'll make a great impact on special teams. I do well at that, and I know how to run the hustle to the ball and everything, and um, play safety as well. Is this a dream realized for you? Is this kind of, you know, been what you've always wanted the whole time? Yes, sir. Is it just talk about your feelings being here? And, and oh, yeah. Me, feel, me being here, I feel like I'm home because I'm from Miami, Florida. So everything's right here, and plus my dad's coaching here, so make everything more easier too as well. Does that put more pressure on you that your dad's here or make it easier? How, how does that work? No, it don't really put pressure on me because he treat me like a regular player. He don't like single me out or do things like that. He try to treat me as a regular player as much as possible. I, I'd have to think you probably understand though where he's coming from with these offseason workouts and the conditioning that you probably, yeah. you probably heard that, you know. Before. Yeah, I know what to expect. So <laughs> I know that's why I'll never get cursed. I know what to expect. You know, I think a lot of fans have been surprised by what you've been able to do. Do you feel like you've surprised a lot of people? Yes, I think I've surprised a lot of people because a lot of people don't know my potential, really, because a lot of people haven't seen me play. Coach Golden said that you were kind of ahead of the game with the mental aspect of the game, that you really kind of knew this, what was going on already. Why do you think that is? Were you just Have you been studying more, or do you just understand the game of football more than most? or how, why, why do you think that is? I've been studying more, like summertime. Because the coaches, like, they give us something to work on for the summer development. They say you either, um, what you need to work on. They told you what your flaws was, and you have to work on it. Like, I know my flaw was getting in the post read and studying my playbook more. So, the summertime, that's what I was doing. I was really in my playbook as much as every day, just studying my playbook. Who's someone that's kind of helped you along on the team? Has there been a mentor, a guy that's helped give you advice in the secondary? Oh, yeah, um, Ray Ray. Ray Ray, VT. I mean, all of us help each other, but I mainly be with um, Ray Ray all the time. Like, that's what, but mainly we help each other. Everybody helps each other in the secondary. Okay. I wanted to ask you, I guess Ray Ray was talking yesterday about something that you to do with the whole soft tape. Mm -hmm. Can you just talk about that? Just um, kind of, you know, oh, the soft tape? Yeah, yeah. The soft tape, yeah. I think if you had a soft tape, I think that really helped because nobody would want to get put on the soft tape. So therefore, everybody going to go hard because you don't want to get laughed at. So that's why you have a soft tape and a tough tape. So everybody try their best to make a tough tape. As of yesterday, I don't think it was no soft tapes. Okay. Is that fun for you guys? I mean, having... Yeah, it's fun because you get to see, because you don't see what's going on on the other field. And then when you're watching the soft tape and they show you who's been soft, and you see what's going on on the other field. When you see guys on the soft